Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy VIII. Last time we started, we just started it off. And this time, we are going to try to catch ourselves a runner. Ha! Time for the true gameplay of Final Fantasy VIII! The card game, Triple Triad. Uh, I am not even really joking. Uh, oh, there it is. The music was a little bit delayed there. Uh, I'm probably going to lose, frankly, but... Okay, yeah, that that's really broken. That music. <laughs> uh... Hmm. Well, can't take that. Uh... Okay. Achievement get! Also, we're not going to do that again for a little while until I have some better cards. <laughs> I wonder if that card ability has anything to do with it. No, not the training center. Actually, I feel like, shouldn't there be music playing here? There it is. Yeah, maybe the music is just a little bit broken in this. Actually, I forgot to mention this in the first episode. Very important to say, I did replace... There's a pretty easy music replacement you can do for Final Fantasy VIII. Because the PC version has, frankly, inferior music. But you can replace it with the original music files that... Okay, wait. Back up a step. The reason the music is inferior is basically because they use a bad music format for the music they put in it. But it's easy to correct it by just swapping those files out. It's a very easy mod to do, and I did that here. Which... Having now said this, I'm really hoping that's not responsible for the musical glitches that I seem to be experiencing. <laughs> but I think that is still important to note. Hmm... Okay, yeah, there's definitely something wrong with the music. Uh, hmm. I'm gonna need to look into that. But later. Uh, fortunately, it's not of critical importance right now. This guy here is another good person to play cards against, but not right now. We don't have any good cards. Hello there. Well, the sound effects are working. They all sound great. Cure! Yes, I'll take that. Hey, she's not wearing her uniform anymore. 
I have a few things to explain before we head off. I know how to do- don't you f Damn it, Quizzest! Ah, uh, I thought I could skip this tutorial. Oh, okay, I can. Good. I know how to do this. <laughs> and I even showed it. Er, well, I didn't really, did I? Hmm. Right, so, we got Quizzes now. We are going to give her Quizzicles. We are going to give her Draw and Quizzical, right? Magic and Item. Uh, and I just need to double check this. Okay, good. Now, I also, I picked up this stuff. I'm going to give it all to Quizzes here. Because she actually has a magic command. Welcome to the world map! Uh, let's see. Okay. This globe is a lie. By the way. <laughs> this world is still a... Ge a, uh... Geometrically impossible donut. But it's a geometrically impossible donut that they tricked you into thinking was a sphere. Uh... Let's see, I want to save, I said save. Now, uh, we want to go a little bit over there, I believe. However, before we do that, I want to go to the beach here. Okay, that broken music is actually driving me freaking crazy. We, we're we here because we want to draw magic from these monsters. That's what draw does. We can cast magic or we can stalk it. If you stalk it, it goes into your inventory. If you draw it, well, it does that. Or rather, if you use it, it you cast it. Uh, now, I'm going to be putting a pretty hard limit on the amount of drawing that I will be doing in this game. Uh, actually, I can kill one of these. <laughs> like, I'm only going to do it for mostly for rare spells. But there's a certain amount of setup that's required, I think. And we're going to be doing that pretty front-loaded. Also, you can auto-crit with Squall over there by hitting R1 right as his blade hit, hits an enemy. Just an interesting little thing to keep in mind. Okay, so, I want 100 Blizzard, I, I only want a little bit of scan, because, well, yeah, I don't need very much scan, only a little bit, but I want a lot of Blizzard, I think I already have the scan even, no, I want a little bit more scan, and while I'm collecting Blizzard I'll probably get grab some sleep as well, but it's not really... Well, actually, no. Sleep will be useful later on, so it will actually save me some time to get it now. Uh, so, I'm going to draw a hundred of each of those, and I will come back when I'm done. So, see you in a couple minutes, probably. Aha! Limit breaks! Anyway, that took probably about f between 8 and... Aw oh man, no victory music. Ugh. 
Right, that took between five and eight minutes, probably. Not that long. So, I want to explain what I just did for a... Because there's a couple of different reasons behind it. You see, later on... Ah, I don't want to fight you some you more. Oh, these are different. Well, I could... Yeah, I know. We've already covered this quiz list. Hmm. I mean, I'm gonna do that once, but then I'm gonna run. Wait. Uh. There we are. Okay, so, as I was saying, there's a couple different reasons I did this. Later in the game, we are going to have the ability to create magic from items. And this is how we're going to get most of our magic outside of a couple of rare spells. However, for those cases where we can't do that, um, drawing is actually based on your magic stat. If you have a, if the, your target has a low magic defense and you have a high magic attack, you will draw more spells. Therefore, it is quicker to you draw with a character that has high magic. Like so. I wonder if Blizzard might actually be better. <laughs> uh, whatever. It doesn't really matter. We're going to get better spells for this later on. These are mostly placeholders, but they're placeholders that will get us started. Right, where was I before I was rudely interrupted? Uh... This is where I was. So, the other reason we did it like this is because it is highly beneficial for us to do... Uh, encounter, or at least gain experience from as few battles as possible. This is because... Uh... The power of enemies scales based on our level, but but we scale more directly based on our junctions than our level. It is better for us to keep a low level, at least until relatively late in the game, as it will result in weaker enemies, while we can still become stronger with better and better magic. Having said that, uh, hmm, you know, I might actually, hmm, let me think here. I want to continue on, but I also really, like, that music thing is really bothering me. Uh, well. There's one more thing I can do. There's actually one other enemy here that I do want to- around here that I do want to fight. Uh, these aren't it. That is! I'm not really interested in drawing anything from the caterpillar here, or it's something like that. Uh, although I can draw a cure, hmm. Right, well, anyway, uh, let's kill the bite me's first. What I actually want here is an item that this guy drops. And we're going to try it once. And if it doesn't work, then it doesn't work. I also need to remember to go into my config after this, because I haven't done that yet, and it is not set up the way I want it to be set up. I'm pretty sure I can actually draw fire from these bugs. Come to think of it. Yep. 
So that means that the big guy probably has thunder. It actually might be worthwhile to stock up on cure as well. Um, here's what I'm gonna do. Quiz this. Now that she has enhanced magic, can draw cure while Squall is going to kill it. Which, truth be told, is probably a lot closer to the draw dynamic I'm going to be going for throughout much of the rest of this game. Sort of. I mean, I don't know, it's sort of hard to describe, because eventually I'll hit a point where it's just not worthwhile to draw anything except for really rare spells, which I will invariably want to stock up as much on as possible. Oh, killed it. Oh, you know, I should have drawn Cure from it to heal. Oh, well. Did I get my item? Uh, I did not. Oh, well. I said I was only going to do one attempt, so... Config! Uh, I need this on freaking memory mode. Uh, always. This is... Uh, this is important. Yeah, that's fine. I can increase speed a little. Okay. And we'll save again. And I will stop off here. Join me next time when we enter the fire cavern and also I've, after I've fixed the damn music. Again. Until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy 8 with Chaos Balloon. Have a great day. Bye! Thank you.